to Hills in the City. I'm super pumped. Today I'm going to show you guys my full collection of bikinis for summer 2020. So these are all the bikinis I bought while sitting in quarantine and waiting for summer to get here. So I'm going to show you all my bikinis I picked out for the summer, what I think the trends are, uh, colors I love, and they're all super cheap. Most of them are around $20 range. So Nasty Gal, uh, Pretty Little Thing, stuff like that. And then I also got some that are a little higher end for the girls that want to spend more money on a bikini. I'm going to show you my Show Me Your Moo Moo and Else Face. So stay tuned. I'm going to run through my whole bikini collection for this summer. Bikini season, here we come. Okay, so my first bikini I'm showing you guys today is from Pretty Little Thing. This is a mint blue high-waisted bikini. Uh, bottoms aren't super cheeky, but just a little. Uh, top is made of a super thin material, and it's kind of like cinched looking. Sorry, I'm peeling. I was at the beach last weekend wearing all of these bikinis. Okay, so yes, bikini uh, fits true to size. I'm wearing a size 6 on Pretty Little Thing, which is a medium. So it fits me pretty well. I think if you're a little bigger up top, be wary with this one. I'm gonna link all these bikinis that are still available below, and if I can't find them, I'm gonna link something similar. So definitely check that out. I'm gonna show you a few more I got from Pretty Little Thing. Stay tuned. So next up from Pretty Little Thing is this black bandeau bikini, high-waisted bottoms again. Uh, same cheekiness in the back as the prior swimsuit. So this is a great swimsuit, a staple piece for summer. If you just want that little black swimsuit to lay out in, this is a great little bandeau shape. The only thing with this one is the top is pretty small. So this is again a six uh, medium in pretty little thing, but I might have sized up in the top just so I had a little bit more coverage and I wasn't always pulling it up. Another $20 buy. This one was super cheap and it's definitely worth it. The material is pretty thick on this one and it's not see-through. Like the blue is a little bit sheer. Um, this one I'm also gonna link below, so definitely check it out. Okay, so last up from Pretty Little Thing, I have this neon green bikini. It has little straps, not much support there at all, so do not count on these. This is basically a strapless swimsuit. I'm getting all the support really from this band. So there is like this elastic band that's a different material than uh, this kind of cinched material. So high-waisted bottoms. Again, I think all the bottoms are the same. These green, the blue, and the black, they're all the same material, the same cheekiness, high-waisted. So this is a pretty cute swimsuit. I love it. I would wear this uh, to the beach to hang out with friends. I love the neon colors for this summer. I feel like they're super in, um, especially on tan skin. So once you get tan and you put on your neon bikini, I think you'll feel amazing um i love this one and it was super cheap another 20 dollars buy from pretty little things so that rounds up pretty little thing bikinis next we're gonna go to l space okay so you're looking at my favorite bikini of the summer uh, i just got it right before quarantine started and i love it it's kind of like a light purplish blue it's hard to tell on camera the color but it has this fun like fringe all the way around uh, the bottoms are not cheeky, but they are high-waisted, and then the straps actually do give you some support, so they're kind of pull you up a little bit and uh, keep everything in there. I love the color, especially on tan skin. This is a higher-priced bikini, so make sure you love it before you buy it, but I'm also going to link it below. It's one of my favorites, and I love L Space. <laughs> Okay, so we are moving on to Shein. Uh, Shein is one of those places to get swimsuits that are like $12. This one was so cheap and it's literally one of my favorites. It is one shoulder, has that high waisted. The material is better than anything I get from Nasty Gal, Pretty Little Thing. Like this is actually a really good quality swimsuit. I just posted a picture in this one. I obviously love it. I love the two-tone colors. Um, I also ordered another one from Shein because I ordered like 30 from Shein, so I don't want to try every single one on for you guys, but uh, this one is also similar, and it has like this little white belted piece in the front, and then like plain black bottom. So I'm going to link both of these. They're very similar with that one shoulder look. I think that the black and the white is super flattering. Again, on tan skin or pale skin, doesn't really matter because it has that black in it, but for summer, love these colors, love the neon colors. You're going to see a lot of that in this video, so stay tuned for way more color but um if you love the one shoulder definitely check these two out they're good quality i approve uh i think you'll like them second bikini from shein i guess third 
uh, second one I'm trying on is this little hot pink one. I love this one. I love the material, the little belt. It is high-waisted and then bandeau style on the top. It's not super cheeky, so you don't have to worry about that. From Shein, it is important to know to size up. So I forgot to mention in the last swimsuit I tried on that I'm wearing a large in Shein. And I normally wear a medium. So definitely size up. If it looks super skimpy, double size up. Um, Shein is a little weird on a lot of quality and a lot of sizing. So be careful when shopping on Shein. A little hint for anyone who's shopping on Shein. I got this from someone who followed me on Instagram actually. Um, if you go to the top right corner and filter by quality or review, so review, like put highest reviews first, that's where I bought all of these. So you're gonna get the ones with the best reviews so they're not super skimpy, they look like the picture, and they're good quality swimsuits. These are all padded, which is awesome. Uh, I'll show you the only one from Shein that's not padded, but this one is so fun, like bright pink. I love the color, uh, I love the fit, and I definitely love this little belted section in the middle. I'm wearing another swimsuit from Shein, uh, bright yellow, kind of neon highlighter color. This one does not have pads and is a little bit showy. The bottom, same way, they're a little skimpy in the back. Um, it's not the best because there's no pads and it is a little bit risky, but it's super cute. I love the bright yellow. Um, definitely if you're around your family or you want something a little more conservative, I understand, go with the first two. This one's just more fun for like hanging out with your friends, going to the beach, maybe you're in college, I don't know. But I love this one. Uh, it looks really good on tan skin too. So this is almost like wearing a white bikini. You're getting that bright, bright yellow. So that contour is gonna look amazing. <laughs> So you're looking at another Shein bikini. This is actually one of my favorites of the summer. Um, I love the little belted trend that's going on right now. I love that they're up here as well. So you get those belt uh, straps and then that belt in the center. Uh, this one's kind of high-waisted. It doesn't go all the way up, but uh, it does have like a good cut and it's a little bit cheeky. Obviously, this one is a little bit more fun. Uh, this kind of reminds me of Euphoria. Emma, you'll get the joke. The material is this like metallic -y snake skin, alligator skin. I'm pretty sure it's snake skin, but it's so cute. It's really good quality material. It has pads in it. Um, I love this swimsuit. I can't wait to wear this all summer long and I love the all black. Okay, so this next one is another Shein bikini. Uh, it's kind of high-waisted bottoms. They can kind of go either way. And then a top with another little belted feature right here. This one's a little bit different. It's more like a strap. Uh, this one has really thick support. Like, it feels tight up top. The bottoms are good. They're not too cheeky. Uh, I really like this one, too. I, I like the color. You saw my Pretty Little Thing one in the similar color. The quality of this one is actually better than the one from Pretty Little Thing. It has pads in it. It feels tighter and better. Um, I would go Shein over Pretty Little Thing unless you just love one at Pretty Little Thing, which I obviously did. So they're good to have as little throw around bikinis, but I do love the ones from Shein, especially with that good quality and good customer reviews. <laughs> moved on to nasty gal i'm wearing my first nasty gal bikini this one is animal print like alligator skin and the material is a little weird it feels like a towel material which i kind of like uh it ties in the back the bottoms are not cheeky they're pretty good to go there these are high-waisted uh this is just like an easy little throw on bikini if you want to lay out go get on the boat go to the beach i like it i like it it's a fun print but also gives me that bandeau tan line um, I'm wearing, again, a size 6, which in Nasty Gal is a medium. So, back to normal sizing for Nasty Gal. I really like this one, though. So, check it out. I'm going to wear another one in a second that's pretty similar. But I like that there's a lot of little patterns for really cheap pricing. I'm wearing another Nasty Gal bikini. This one is the legit perfect line for me to lay out. It's not high-waisted, and it does have that bandeau shape up top. This one does not tie in the back, so... The back looks like that. Um, you just have to put it on over your head or however you want to step into it. And the bottoms are a little skimpier than the last one. So beware, this one also doesn't have pads. This is more of just like a throw on around your house laying out bikini. Um, it's definitely like 
I think I paid $13 for it. So like worth the quality. Yeah, who cares? Like it's just another cute pattern. It kind of looks like a picnic table. But I really do like this one and I love the stuff on Nasty Al. I mean, obviously it's kind of low quality, but it's like how many times are you gonna wear this bikini? Maybe like for two months and then toss it. Who cares for $13, right? Right. Again, uh, size six in this bikini. You are seeing my first ever, my one and only uh, one piece. <laughs> I don't like one pieces. This one was on sale for like $50 on Show Me Your Moo, Moo So I was like, okay, I have to get it. I love the quality of Show Me Your Moo, Moo swimsuits. I love the prints, obviously. This one is in the Great Tiger print. Um, this one's actually pretty flattering. Like it gives you some cleavage. It's like pretty cheeky, but not too cheeky in the back, which is good, bad. I don't know what you think about that. I would actually wear this one maybe like on a tropical vacation or just somewhere beachy and fun. Uh, I'm not definitely not a one piece girl. So don't take my advice if you're a one piece girl but I actually do like this one. This one is a size medium. Um, it doesn't have pads, which is good to know. Actually, speaking of pads, I don't think any of my Moo Moo swimsuits have pads, so just note that. Um, I'm gonna try on one more though, so. You are viewing the last bikini of my haul for the summer. This is also my favorite bikini. So, this is Show Me Your Moo Moo, obviously. Uh, that palm sprint that I love. I like have three sweaters in the palm sprint, two swimsuits. They just released a new swimsuit in a different palm sprint. I love, love, love the palms. Uh, it's a high-waisted bottom and a tie top. So this is a very common style for Moo Moo swimsuits. Um, I love the style. I have two different ones in the same style, different patterns. So you can pick a different one if you don't like this one. They have animal print, they have solids, everything. It's just really flattering, the style. You have that high-waisted and then the tie top so you can adjust it however you want. So just for reference, I am wearing a medium top and a small bottom. Um, you can kind of take that with a grain of salt. I mean, everything on Moo Moo is pretty well sized. If you have any questions about it, just shoot me a message and um, we'll talk, it. I'll help you. I don't know. I don't know. I'm not a Moo Moo expert. I pretend I am, but just kidding. I kind of am. Yeah, so favorite swimsuit. This is the one right here. It's best for last. I love Moo Moo Swim. I think they're great quality. They don't have pads, but like that really doesn't even, I don't know. Sometimes that matters. Sometimes it doesn't, but it's not a deal breaker for me. I love their stuff. Okay, well that's the end of my try-on haul for all of my bikini collection for this summer. I hope you guys liked it. Thank you so much for watching. Uh, if you just watched to look at one particular bikini or you just want to get some inspo for the whole summer, I hope this video helped you out a little bit. Hit that subscribe button and hit the bell so you get post notifications when I post every single Sunday. Love you guys.